Hey guys, Joe and John here with sandblastingmachines.com and today we're going to be talking to you about tungsten carbide nozzles. Now the inside of nozzles wear over time, so choosing the right composition and material is important. And tungsten carbide is a great option because not only does it have a high resistance, but it's also cost effective. Yeah, you're right on there, Joe. Uh, tungsten carbide also offers the best value. You know, you'll see looking on our site, uh, tungsten carbide versus silicon carbide is slightly less uh, money. Uh, they're also very rugged, durable, and they in, uh, resist impact. So meaning if you're going to drop that on the ground or if it's going to hit off something, it's less likely to break. Great for harsh worksite conditions. Correct, yeah. So, and then uh, it works well with most abrasives. Okay. And uh, you're going to get about 300 hours of blast time out of these nozzles, depending on the uh, pressures you're blasting at and the type of media you're using. Okay, anyway, so when it comes to the tungsten carbide nozzles, what kind of styles are we looking at here? Uh, at sandblastmachines.com, we carry two different styles. We have your uh, short barrel style, which is our CT nozzle, and then we also have the uh, long venturi style, uh, available at TSP, TMP, TXP, TJP, and TYP. A lot of T's. Yeah, a lot of T's. And they have a durable jacket made from natural rubber? Right, yeah, so that's going to make it a little more comfortable for the operator to hold, and it also helps uh, resist some of that impact. All right, perfect. So when we're talking about composition, we have standard thread and contractor thread with almost everything, it seems like. So what what uh, are the differences there? The contractor thread has become the industry standard with Klemco, right. uh, but we also offer their uh, inch and quarter standard thread uh, type nozzles. So when you're looking at a long venturi style nozzles, you're going to see options, contractor thread, and one and a quarter standard thread. One and a quarter standard thread looks just like pipe thread. Okay. Uh, and then you're also going to see our CT nozzle. That's a three quarter thread nozzle, much smaller right. uh, three quarter threading on that. So. And that's good for when you're blasting very close. Yeah. If you were going to be within 18 inches or smaller type applications, that's where you're going to be uh, tend to use a CT nozzle. CT nozzles are going to be paired with a, a smaller blast unit in general. So. And then finally, um, the, I, I see here we have a couple different you know options here, but sizes for the nozzles are important as well. Not only the length obviously but the orifice. Right yeah orifice size is really what we want to pay attention to you know the orifice size of the nozzle is going to help us determine uh, you know that you have a big enough air compressor and that you're using a proper size uh, blast hose. Okay. Um, one of the things you really want to pay attention to with that orifice is once it wears about a sixteenth of an inch it's time to replace you know somebody's using a number four quarter inch orifice nozzle uh, blast it at 100 psi using 80 CFM of air all of a sudden that doesn't seem like it's enough or that doesn't seem like that's blasting like it was Take a look at that orifice size because there's a very good chance it's time to replace. Okay, so like you don't necessarily need to pull out a tape measure every time you're done blasting. You can feel it. The machine's almost going to tell you it's, okay. it's time to change. You know, it's important because you know using the wrong nozzle size is going to result in inefficient blasting. Right. Uh, you know, too large of a nozzle, you're going to have uh, low blast pressure and you're going to have rapid wear on the blast hose. Okay. If you go too small a nozzle, uh, smooth media flow is going to be really difficult to achieve. All right, right on. So yeah, pay attention to that airflow. If you see any fluctuations in your CFM or uh, you know, the same PSI is not pushing the same amount of media, it might be time to check the nozzle. That's right. All right, great. Well, thanks for the explanation, John. You guys can find all of our tungsten carbide nozzles in the nozzle section on sandblastingmachines.com. Always free shipping over $75. And for John, I'm Joe. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, guys.